Let's open it up. All right. Nice. Ready now. Hey guys, it's Leif here. As you can see, I got a beard since the last time we saw each other. But this video isn't going to be about me and my beard. It's going to be an unboxing video. Now, I just picked up a hard drive the other day and I thought I would share the unboxing with you guys. So without further ado, let's do this. So what we got here is the Seagate Backup Plus Hub. It's eight terabytes, uh, Windows, Mac, whatever you could use it with everything, uh, USB 3. Also, I picked up a uh, the power bank here, it's only 3,000 milliamp hours, so it's not that big, but it was on sale, it was like five bucks. I've never had a power bank before, so I was just like, yeah, let's just pick it up and see. Uh, I have an iPhone 6, uh, 6S that I use, and it, supposedly you're supposed to get like one to two charges from this little thing. So it could be a cool little backup thing to have, and if I'm out shooting, and if I run out of batteries and stuff like that, I mean, plug it in and at least I can get a couple extra shots with the phone, something like that. I don't know. But yeah, let's open this up and uh, take a look. Cardboard. Oh, that's really in there, isn't it? Let's see if we can. Come on. Huh. Son. Oh, look at that. See, so that's what it looks like when you first open up the box. Let's be a little bit gentle now. Okay, so whatever, desktop, quick start. I know how to use a hard drive, so that's okay. It's, uh, it's not too bad, it's not so heavy. I think there's only supposed to be one drive inside of this. All right, look at that. It's not so bad, okay, so it has some little feet underneath there, some little uh, rubber feet for it to stand on. That's the front, uh, so we got some USB plugs. They're uh, read only, not write, but you can like charge uh, whatever your iPhone or some kind of USB devices, iPad, something like that through here. It's supposed to be like if you plug in uh, another hard drive, you can read it through here, but you can't write to it. I don't know, so I'll have to test that out. But yeah, first uh, look, it's pretty cool. It looks nice. USB plug in the back, power source in the back, not bad. Ooh. All right, cool. I mean, there's, yeah, that's it. Nothing really else to say, I guess. Let's just uh, plug it in and uh, start to set it up. First, let's uh, let's just see what else is in ah, the box, come on. All right, so that's the box empty. So we got power stuff, that's that. USB, power supply. European plug, Norwegian, Norwegian plug, European plug, and uh, other plug. Yeah, power supply. Oh, look, I've never seen this kind of thing before. Push to open. Yeah. Oh, that's kind of cool. Let's open up the power bank. All right, so that's the device thing to charge it with, and well, it's pretty simple. I mean, it's tiny, uh, very light, <laughs> nice and smooth. It's like a nice sort of like smooth black surface. All right, so I guess that's the side to charge it. And then you just plug in any kind of USB thing uh, in here to, to charge. Cool, it's small, it's light. Uh, it's supposed to be waterproof, I think. Uh, don't quote me on that, because I'm not sure, I'd have to look it up. But uh, water resistant, there you go. Easy charging, battery indicator, charging one to two times, dust resistant, good grip. Yes, it is a good grip. Let's make it look pretty. You know what we should do? We should just plug this in and set this up and then we could probably charge this from here. Let's, let's see if that works. So as you guys can see, this is my current setup. This is the uh, Lacy D2 Thunderbolt 2 8 terabyte drive. That's uh, just a Seagate uh, portable, whatever it's called, four terabyte. It's part of where I, uh, it's part of my backup uh, system right now. Now the hard drive isn't running right now; it's off. Like uh, so, that's why I dare to move it. So that looks good. All right, so there it just popped up. 
start here, Mac. Cool. Yeah, if you want to use this drive with for time machine backups, let your Mac format the drive. This utility erase. All right, so let's call this guy time machine, aka aka the TARDIS two volume two. All right, done. Cool, so the way that my setup is right now, my main drive is called the TARDIS. Uh, that's the Lacy D2 Thunderbolt 2 8 terabyte drive. And then Time Machine 4 terabytes, that's just my backup so far, but it's, it's only 4 terabyte. Uh, but I mean, in the TARDIS, uh, I've only used, uh, it's just under 4 terabytes, I think, that I've used so far. Now, here's the new one, Time Machine, also known as the TARDIS Volume 2. And then this here one, Win and Games, this is just Window and Games. It's a 500 gigabyte partition on the TARDIS, on the Lacy drive um, that I have. It's just Windows installed and GTA 5 so far. So yeah, let's set up Time Machine and start making the first backup. All right, so let's see here. Add or remove disk. Time Machine, also known as the use disk. Yes. All right, so check it out. Time Machine, also known as the TARDIS Volume 2, 400 megabytes of 3.26 terabytes. All right, great, that's awesome. Here is the you know, charge power bank. This in, and uh, test out the hub for the first time. Let's see if this will charge it. Yeah, there's some little lights there that just came on, so I guess that's charging. Is it all the way charged? I don't know, the lights are on. Ah, there's some lights on. We'll just leave that like that for a little bit and then uh, see what happens. All right guys, so that was it for today's unboxing video. I hope you enjoyed it. I had a really good time. Um, please give it a thumbs up. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. I really appreciate the support and I would love to hear your thoughts about it. And I'll read your comments and I'll write a little reply as well. Um, so yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Have a wonderful day and I'll see you in the next one. Don't forget to subscribe. What? Oh, right. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new to the channel. All right. See you guys.